Hey, what's up everybody? It's Ollie from Flight Comp, and I'm happy to say I finally finished the uh, Mini Optimus project, and I have it sitting on the bench here. So I was able to get all the servos and everything in it and get all the controls hooked up. I did some uh, programming on the radio and have everything working. Um, I took some pictures of the servo installation and the controls and everything, and I'll just uh, run those by you right now. As you can see, you get the motor and spinner and everything on it. I have a, uh, ended up just getting some kind of cheapo Hobby King Outrunner because I couldn't find any suitable inrunners. So it's a little bit tricky to uh, get the motor installed, but I have it in there. I have a 30 millimeter um, Vlad Hyper Spinner, and this is a 8x6 Groppner folding prop. I got the canopy uh, laid up and installed. And under the hood, I have a uh, Talon 15 uh, speed control, a uh, 600 milliamp 3S battery, and um, I'm just using the uh, BEC off the speed control. Uh, the servos and everything are all Bluebird 101 uh, HV servos. Um, not that they're actually running high voltage, but I just had them, so I used them. Um, so I got the servo in each wing, and then I have actually the um, two tail servos under here. That You, you saw that in the uh, pictures that I showed you. So yeah, there she is. Um, balance is about here-ish. I might put a smidge of lead in the tail just to bring the CG back. It's, I think it's probably slightly nose-heavy. Um, I might test fly it like this and see. Better to be nose-heavy than uh, tail-heavy. But yeah, everything works, so I'll show you the radio setup I got real quick. We have uh, aileron travel, and then I actually set up some flaps on a three position switch. So I have like, uh, kind of maybe like a little camber setting here, and then uh, a little more, I could use this for landing flaps. I don't know, I don't know how such a small plane like this will react to flaps, but uh, I put it in there. You know, just to see how it, how it goes. So yeah, got some dual rates on the ailerons set up. This is probably too much. And then uh, moving back to the tail. Got my V-tails working. Up and down. And then left and right. And I have a little, just a little bit of uh, rudder mixing with ailerons, not much. I can add or take out uh, as I need. But yeah, so everything's done. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go see if this thing actually flies. So uh, stay tuned and uh, let's go fly this thing. Is there any wind? I'll just throw it this way. Alright. Just a hand pump. Little, uh. Is it really nose heavy or had a lot of down trim in it? <laughs>
turns pretty good. Yeah, it looks really good. Like it doesn't feel like it's heavy. No, it looked pretty floaty. You just shim it, huh? Because I think, right? Is the motor still on? Doesn't sound like it. Cool, that looks fun. Definitely need to change the motor thrust. Feels up really bad. Sorry. 